Mewen from World Entertainment. And yes, that was the teaser trailer for Alien Earth. <laughs> Very teaser because it's 15 seconds long. And yes, this is the official release of that trailer that leaked online. Why did it leak online and how? Well, they played it before Alien Romulus in some theatres, apparently. So that's where it came from. But we now have that trailer officially released an indication of a release date and a synopsis i've now, already known what the story was for this show but when you hear it you're gonna roll your eyes because you've already guessed it it's female centric well actually no that's a lie it's not female centric but the main character is a woman which is it's a, whatever you know if that's the road they want to keep going down fine whatever it, the, the funny thing is alien is more suited uh, as the franchise to be fronted by a woman predator isn't and yet that's what they're doing with predator but we'll have a look at this little article and it is a very short article here on avp galaxy uh, and it gives you the synopsis for what this show is so it says while freddy alvarez's alien romulus continues to ride high at the box office which it is actually currently doing at the moment it's sitting at 288.5 million dollars at the box office worldwide box office that is uh, on a budget of 80 so it's in profit at this stage that's including with the um marketing budget so it's a hit profit uh, so everything it makes now is starting to turn profit for them so it continues saying fx networks has officially announced alien earth and dropped a teaser trailer also shown in front of some showings of alien romulus in the us which is what we said there a minute ago and our first synopsis of what we can expect from noah holly's upcoming alien series so this is what it says it's about and also gives us an indication of when we can expect this thing so it says, when a mysterious space vessel crash lands on Earth, a young woman, Sydney Chandler, that's the actress, not the character, and a ragtag group of tactical soldiers make a fateful discovery that puts them face to face with the planet's greatest threat in FX's highly anticipated TV series, Alien Earth, from creator Noah Hawley, FX Alien Earth original series coming in 2025 only on hulu so we are getting it in 2025 that is now officially confirmed when exactly in 2025 we're not 100 percent sure but we know they have wrapped filming this thing uh, so i would assume i would say probably around march it might be when they try and aim for march or april i wouldn't be surprised could be later we could end up getting that horrendous news that oh we're gonna drop it in the fall which means now in a year's time you'd be like really why would you want to wait that long the teaser trailer uh, it's really a nothing teaser trailer you know it's literally 16 seconds long 15 16 seconds earth transforms into the xenomorph the only thing that's a bit discouraging about that teaser um is the fact that the xenomorph does seem to be cgi i don't know whether or not they went the practical effects road with this movie or show i should say we also know that they do want this to be uh multiple seasons they don't just want it to be a one-off or anything they want multiple seasons if alien romulus is anything to go by then i would assume that there will be interest in this um, which I did talk about with one of the videos. Can't remember whether it was for Romulus or this. Um, where I did break down that if Romulus flopped, it would spell disaster for this series. But Alien Romulus seems to be doing well. It's doing better internationally than it is domestic. Domestic, it's standing at 91 million. Um, and internationally, it's at... 197.4 million so uh it's it's doing well and um, even stateside it's doing well you know not great compared to the budget but still it's doing very well and it's just it's just trodden along you know sitting in 
second place at the box office. So the interest then for this series will probably be there. Now, of course, the issue is it's on Hulu, which means it'll be on... I, I don't know if it's still called Star, uh, this side of the world on Disney+. Plus or what the hell where you watch it whether it's just through disney plus but it'll be that way over here so there'll be probably some sailing on the black pearl with jack sparrow to watch this thing <laughs> um maybe um the timney oliphant is also in this as well and apparently he has a big role now even though the synopsis here is talking about this space vessel crashes and we've seen the uh, concept art um which i'll probably have throughout this video that you you'll be seeing that shows the ship crashed they film this in thailand um so it's definitely gonna have a different look this is a prequel series to the entire alien franchise so this isn't gonna be in between alien and aliens it's not gonna be connected to romulus or anything it's set before alien don't know though whether or not any connection will be in place for uh, Prometheus and Covenant. I hope not, because that is where Alien Romulus drops the ball when they directly connect to that. No indication whether or not this show will do that. There's actually still no in, even though it is a prequel, because it's set, um, and they've said it's a prequel to the overall franchise, but they've never said whether it's actually connected properly to the Alien franchise. And if they're on Earth, you would assume probably not. It's going to be interesting. But with the synopsis saying about this ship crashed on Earth and yada yada yada, we know the main story is actually this young woman played by Sydney Chandler. That it's meant to be her and I, the only thing, I can never remember whether it's her brother dies or her sister dies. And their consciousness is uploaded into a synthetic body. But it's a different gender from what they were. I think it's her brother that passes away and is put into a female android body. Or else it's vice versa. It's a sister and it's into a male body. And they have to try and come to terms with not just are they, their consciousness living on and they're in this new body. But it's the fact that, oh my god, it's a different gender body. But... It did seem to be focusing a little more on synthetics, which of course Ridley Scott is involved in this as well. So that's where the red flag comes up. I don't think he was as hands on, like I don't think he was ever on set for this. I don't think he really had much input. Uh, so they say he could just be an executive producer in name only. And one could only hope because you know for a fact that the ending of Alien Romulus was his, his influence so we'll wait and see and if this teaser trailer is officially being dropped i wouldn't be surprised if by december or so we end up getting an official trailer we'll see so with that i shall leave it there for this one so like share subscribe you know the drill by now cheers and i will catch you in the next one